Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Kraken King. Just figured I'd give you guys a little bit of an update. Uh, nothing special, just figured I'd put something out there for like my two subscribers. But, uh, let's start this off without getting interrupted again. Um, so this here was my first off-road tractor I built. It's an MTD chassis, so it's just got the really poor transaxle. It's got the best tires and the best motor uh, for dependability anyways. My son's little 50cc two-stroke. But anyways, uh, this is called the Kraken. Um, it's got the nice 22-inch tires on the back. They are plugged up, but um, they hook up pretty good, and that just gives it a good look. Got a uh, utility rack here on the back, just made out of two lawnmower handles, inverted, welded together, and supported. And then uh, it's also got the solar charger on the back for hooking an inverter up to, and then I put power tools on it, and I can go out and do trimming or trail cutting and stuff just to kind of cut the way for radical over there. Uh, it's got a 7-speed, but it's just like you guys know, it's just a single transaxle, single gear transaxle. Um, it has a little foot throttle modification, you know. It's also got this 12.5 horsepower Briggs flathead that's fresh, and that's pretty much the best part of this whole mower. It's my most dependable ride. It starts every time, runs great. It's got a mild pulley swap on it so it does maybe three or four miles an hour faster. It's got the, just a little straight pipe off there onto the rickety removable muffler. A little cup holder and pretty much that's for the fix a flat but it's a nice little ride. Then onto the pride and joy here. This one I've called Radical. Um, it is a Craftsman body. It has got a Spicer in it right now, 5-speed. Uh, it's got the foot throttle, like all the mowers do, except for my grass cutter over there. I had, it needs a lot of work, but I figured I would just give you guys a kind of up-to-date where it's at right now. And as of now, there's a clutch pulley that's out, shifter, linkage needs buttoned up. The trailer hitch on it needs fixed and quite a, a few other little bitty things but it's got the utility rack on the back also it's my most modified one and uh, thanks to a guy named Bill Johnson which I'd purchased it from I uh, plan on giving it a new look this summer so it's got dual pipes um, four inch axle extensions some shredder ATV tires a little extra compartment there in the back, utility rack, ammo box, foot throttle. Also, I just put this bumper on it. I'm going to, hopefully, it's got skid plates front and back on this one, but I'd like to put the skid plate starting up here and then run it all the way back to a belly pan. That way I can nose over logs and things like that when I'm out on a ride. <clears throat> If you guys don't already know, you have to check out Fearless Front's channel. It's on YouTube also. This one has got a 20 horsepower V-twin. It's a 656 cc's, so it's the biggest one. I love it if I could just get that kind of power to the transaxle. I lose a lot with the clutch system and the way the belts slip, but um, that's another upgrade and another time. And then to just cap this off, here's my little grass cutter. Pulled the deck on it, brought it up here for the wife and kids to maybe go for a ride with me. It's absolutely bone stock, except for the redneck battery that's put on the back. I just had the extra battery laying around. I hooked it up. And that's about it. So it's uh, just a yard man. It's got the 500cc single cylinder on it, so it cuts pretty good. It's needing some TLC, but uh, other than that, that's about it, man. So I'll be moving soon. Uh, either place I move to, I'll more than likely have a shop. 
so I need to put Radical up on the lift get it ready for the trails if I don't sell Kraken then I will probably button it up for a trail cutter and I've got a couple other projects going right now I've got the Troy built it's got the V-twin 21 horsepower on it crappy transaxle but uh, I've got another Spicer transaxle going in it and that's also got a MTD donor it's got the opposed twin on it so hopefully I'll be buttoning them up and uh, getting them on the trail too so I'll just keep you guys updated and until next time man stay muddy